I'm excited to be talking about Wildfire and the new enhancements we're introducing that are making it easier for our customers to discover unknown malware, zero-day exploits, and advanced persistent threats. At the end of the day, this is where we're looking at unknown files as they flow across your network in our cloud-based virtual execution environment. We're looking at the real behavior of files. So evasive threats, when they think, feel, and believe they're in a full hardware environment, we can see them, we can detect them, and develop protections for them. And what's key here is that all this data is shared across the entire Wildfire customer base. So wherever you see a threat in the world, we are developing protections in as little as 30 minutes and sharing them. The new things are really all about visibility. We're adding new file types to Wildfire, like Adobe PDFs for those spear phishing attacks that are coming in over webmail and encryption. Java, which can be used for drive-by downloads where you're visiting a common website that's silently infecting you. Office documents that are present in almost every organization, as well as the executables that we've always done, plus Android APKs for mobile malware. Next, zero-day exploit detection. So this is going earlier in the cyber kill chain, so before that malware is delivered, we're detecting the exploitation of vulnerabilities to stop the attacks before they get to you. Finally, it's all about malware intelligence. We're adding more visibility into what the malware has done on your network, such as new indicators of compromise. We're adding the ability to look at the activity of malware in a timeline fashion so you can see step by step what it's done. And not only that, but you can now download the original malicious file. So if you're a particular sophisticated IR team, you can reverse it or look at the packet captures and see the flows as they're in the wildfire cloud. Net net, we're making it easier for security teams and incident response to quickly identify infected hosts and remediate them with speed.